you get two tablespoons of oil, put it in a saucepan. Okay. And put a spoon of cumin seed. You know what the cumin seed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah we have some. One teaspoon of cumin seed you put in there uh -huh. and chop the onion in it. If it's a small one, the whole onion. If it's a big one, half. Half onion. Okay. Put it in there and let it fry until it turns golden brown. Okay. No while water yet. Brown, yeah. While it's turning brown, you wash your rice twice. Oh, okay. First time it's going to take the dirt out. Uh -huh. The second time is going to take the some of the starch. The starch out. Okay. Then what you do? Once the onion turns brown, you put a pinch of salt to your taste uh -huh. and a half cup of water, and you stir it. Let it cook for about like uh, about two three minutes the uh -huh. most. Then you put only the washed rice, not the water. How much rice, rice, by the rice. way, are you putting in this half cup? Huh? How much rice are you putting in there? We will come to that. Okay. Okay. Well, whatever quantity you want to cook, one cup, two cup, three cup, but just you only still start with a half cup of rice. Wash the rice. Right. No just water. Just wash yet. the rice and put it in there. The washed rice, you put it into that mix, uh -huh. and eight other half cup of water, so it will allow you to stir it because the first half cup is not enough. Right. Okay. So you're going to add another half cup after putting the rice in there. Uh -huh. You're stirring it. What you're doing is you are coating the rice with the oil mixture. So the rice will be cooked individual, okay. and it will go longer. Right, right, right. Okay. Ah. Because it won't be sticky either. Right. See, this is always important in the explanations. Is like the why you're doing it. Why you're, you're doing it exactly? Yeah, the right. mechanics so of it, the science of it, right. the chemistry. Yeah. yeah. So once mm -hmm. you put the rice in there, then you pour the water to bury the rice. Okay. Now this comes the quantity. If you cook, you're cooking one cup of rice, uh -huh. then a quarter inch water above the rice level. Okay. If it's two cup, then a half inch. Every cup of rice you add it up, you add another quarter inch of water above the rice level. Okay. And you're cooking okay. this in a pan, not a pot. Is that saucepan. Correct? Oh, no, saucepan. I mean, okay. Yeah. You don't need a. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Pot. yeah. And then, and then what you do after putting the water, you cover the lid on it, let it cook for 20 minutes. 20 minutes later, you pick up your rice and press it. If it's soft. It's done. It's just simmer, not high temperature. No, just medium, medium, medium. heat will be fine. Right. And uh, once the rice is soft, it means it's done. But the brown rice, it takes a little oh, longer than Oh, it takes a minutes. lot longer. In mm -hmm. fact, even basmati rice takes a very short time compared to even normal uh, uh, yeah, short grain. Or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But uh, if it is the brown rice, then you have to leave it for a Long little time, longer. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, you press the rice if it's soft. It's just done. If it is not, because sometimes the rice are stubborn from one to the other because they come from the different provinces, uh -huh. so the, the 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 growing is different. So that's why you need it a little more time than the others. So when you see if it is not cooked, just don't pour more water, but just sprinkle a little bit on it uh -huh. and cover it for another three four minutes. That's it. It's done. This is just the basic. Okay. okay. <laughs> Once you do that, then I will show you how you can add some more spice to that to bring the flavor up, then a few things more, you can add it up and make it even more better. Wonderful. But this basic rice will be good enough to just eat without anything. It will be so tasty. Okay. Wonderful. <laughs> that sounds really good. You're all right. That's great.